first of all came here, Mark, and announced that we would put in uh, $41 million to do the emergency department. It was the biggest emergency department at the time, but it was sorely needed and had wonderful effect on uh, and support from the clinical staff, from patients, from families and carers and all the volunteers and, and the builders and people who'd been involved in this project. I remember going through it on that open day and just watching the community in awe of what had been achieved. But of course that was only stage one. So we needed to go to stage two. So here we are, the highest point in the build of this second stage, <coughs> $77 million. We fast-tracked it, we brought it ahead of time, which enabled us to uh, save some money but keep exactly the same scope of services. So it will include eight new operating theatres, extended uh, ICU, um, new uh, wards and beds, uh, two cardiac cath laboratories, uh, a new sterilising suite and many other things beside. And a new helipad up here and when this is finished extension of the parking this is something that is really needed in this community and I'm extremely thrilled that we've been able to deliver it with the fantastic work of health infrastructure and all of their team and with multiplex and your team all of the builders that have been involved in this project and thank you all very very much for the work that you've done and to allow us to be participants in this very traditional topping out ceremony. We'll have the building itself complete it next year, so it should be operational, we think, maybe early 2018. Okay, with that now, we'd like to uh, do, the, uh, do the topping off tree. Very significant uh, milestone in the construction industry when the building reaches its highest point. The tradition is that you uh, put an evergreen on the very top of the building. It's really encouraging good spirits and good fortune to be placed upon those members of the community and we do it on all of our projects. We're delighted to be doing it here only eight months after starting Minister, so we're, we're absolutely delighted to reach this point.